Hello everyone, in this video we are going to install the Viper for Android sound mode on the Samsung Galaxy UI. Now before you begin installing this mode, please note that if you are on a custom ROM or on a stock ROM and you have a sound mode, some other sound mode, there may appear some conflicts such as DSP manager force closing or uh, your music player force closing and so on. So I would advise you to remove any sound mode you have before installing this just to be on the safe side in case something happens. So just make an Android backup and take the risk. And so anyways, uh, now what we do is you download the files from the link in the video description. It's actually just one zip file that you need to download and uh, you extract it. You do not flush it. You extract it uh, with either WinRAR, 7-zip or with some kind of archive program on your uh, Samsung Galaxy UI. Anyways, once you download it, you should see two files, which is the uh, manager ap key and the fx ap key once you have downloaded the files and have extracted the zip file you should see these two ap key files along with text files uh, the readme and so on and on so anyways first of all we install the manager ap key so install this also please note that this requires a rooted phone as well as busybox installed uh, to have a bigger success rate if you want to install it successfully anyways okay so this is the manager once installed open it and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna choose install update and just choose the first option here you can see uh, the CPUs you have a choice but the Samsung Galaxy wise uh, the first option we will do for the Samsung Galaxy wise processor this is where you will be asked uh, super user access so just allow it and okay the operation is complete as you can see it said that it just installed it now exit this and now install the uh, uh, Viper for Android FX ABK file once again just install this like any normal app once it is done let's just have a quick look at it okay this is what we see here now and uh, now you may just exit this go to settings go to applications manage applications and look for the AP key of the Android FX uh, AP, uh, app. I mean, sorry. And now what you do here is you choose clear data to clean out the settings. And now, as you have saw in the first installation of the first AP key, it said to reboot the phone. So what you do after this is you power off your phone and then you power it back on. So I'll be back once I'm done with this. And now your phone should start back up, hopefully without any force close surprising messages. As you can see, mine has started up normally. So anyways, what you do now is, you look for the app drawer for the Viper for Android app. Now this is the manager here. This app basically installs the drivers, so you are safe to uninstall this app if you do not need it. Uh, it won't uninstall the drivers. It was basically just an inst installer, just like how you install uh, software on your computer you can safely delete the installer app so anyways you can just delete that and now here is the Viper for Android app and as you can see now here we have various options equalizers and so on and on so I cannot go into detail now here on how to set it up and everything else I'm going to leave that up to you uh, for you to feel the changes and so on and on so I'm just going to demonstrate you how I just turn it on and the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to access my uh, my music player okay so I have just enabled it just to show that everything is working fine and there we go the song managed to start up without any problems as you can see it is playing as you can see sound is working it didn't screw that up and yeah and now as you can see when you go to options and sound settings it takes you here so yeah enjoy your your music quality guys that was all you had to do as you can see we have successfully installed Viper for Android also this month has been a bit tough and there's pretty much no content left to post on the blog or videos so I pretty much ran out of ideas on what to upload and what kind of stuff to show you if you have any requests feel free to leave a comment on this YouTube video or on the blog post on what you want to see uploaded next Thank you for watching everyone, I'll see you next time, goodbye.